Hi folks, welcome to the track day. This is uh, the Bennett's track day where I'm taking part on a higher Yamaha R6. Some bikes are about to go past, bear with. And I've already been out on my first session. As you might be able to tell, I'll turn, I'll turn the camera again. Um, it's wet or it's damp. It's actually uh, sprinkling at the moment, which is not good. It was um, very sketchy on the, the Yamaha R6, uh, brand new tires as well. So um, I was very upright. Did a couple of overtakes though, but uh, yeah, it was um, not a lot of fun, <laughs> I'll be honest with you. But I think it's going to be like this pretty much all day. So uh, I'm going to have to suck it up. At least it's not cold. And at least it's not raining harder because none of the kit I'm wearing is waterproof. So uh, yeah, we'll uh, get on to another session in a bit and I'll let you know how I'm getting on. Okay, second session down. I'm just starting to get an idea about the R6. With the R6, what I'm quickly finding is you really got to rev it up to 16,000 RPM on the straights to get it to go quickly. So below about 10,000 RPM, unsurprisingly, there's hardly any power and it actually struggles a little bit to accelerate. But when you get 12, 13, 14, that's when, it's, that's when it starts to go a bit quick. Problem is it's still very damp out here too damp for me to ride confidently basically but um, it's drying up and it's not raining though the clouds are looking rather ominous there's um, some gray out there but in the distance there is a little bit of blue sky so I'm hoping that it gets better for us I won't give you a running commentary of every session but um, if it does dry up then I'll be back see you soon
again. Well, I've had four sessions so far before lunch. The uh, third session was the driest and the most fun. Uh, started raining again a bit, spitting on the fourth one, so it slowed me down a little bit. The heavens opened during lunchtime, so now it's quite wet, but it's uh, dried up again. Well, stopped raining again, but we're basically exactly back to where we were this morning. So yeah, it's not gone as well as I'd hoped, but it's bright out there. Hopefully you'll have a little bit of fun before the end of the day, fingers crossed. Right then, final session is about 15 minutes away. It's uh, there's a dry line forming, <laughs> but it's Donington, it, it's greasy. There's not a lot of confidence um, in leaning the bike over, but the R6 on these uh, Dunlop Mutant tires, I'm just starting to get my head around them in the damp and they grip quite well, but I, I don't know enough really to, uh, to pass a, a, an informed comment on them. But I'm still upright. I haven't crashed, so, so far so good. Bloody love track days. Well, as you can see, I finally uh, paid my first visit to the gravel at Donington. Um, just went a bit too fast through craners, braked a little too late through um, into the old hairpin, and I just panicked basically, just a bit of target fixation, looking straight ahead of me thinking, I'm not making this corner. But I wasn't looking at the corner, <laughs> I was looking at the gravel, and that's exactly where I went. And I think uh, that is my last session. I do have another one I could take, but I'm pretty hot, I'm bothered. I've just had one close call. I think that's good enough for today. Had a great day, although the weather's been pretty ropey. Bit of a shame, but I've enjoyed riding the R6. It's given me a taste for riding the uh, Yamaha R1, which I'll be on in about a month's time when I come back here for the Yamaha Track Skills Day, which is actually with the same firm that I'm with now, which is Moto Events. So they've been a great bunch of guys uh, today. And I'm glad I kept their bike up right as well. <laughs> anyway, that's about it for me. I'm signing off now. I'll see you in another video soon, guys. Take care. Bye.